Good morning. It's early. I'm standing by this house in this plain yellow wall of this house. Uh, and you're thinking, why are you doing that? The reason is I'm about to do a dramatic reveal. Dog barking. Uh, I'm in Saltash in Cornwall, and there are some days when you just need to start a video by suddenly revealing Brunel's Bridge <laughs> right behind you. So with Brunel's Royal Albert Bridge just there, road bridge, and of course the railway bridge, didn't notice this before, it looks like the railway bridge actually goes to a single track. And that's Saltash, hello, good morning. Uh, I'm going to Menheniot and Dockyard request stops, except for the fact that I don't think that Menheniot is actually a request stop anymore. But that's the reason why I'm going there to go and check it out and investigate it. Uh, and after which we'll just do a quickie uh, at Plymouth Dockyard Station, which I know definitely is a request stop. Why is my hair all... I haven't been wearing a hat. Why have I got hat hair already? The next station is St. Gilbert. So Menheniot is on the Great Western Main Line, uh, west out of Plymouth, going down towards Penzance. Uh, but as we'll see from the timetables when we get there, it gets a very limited service. And I think after I get there at 9.42 this morning, uh, there's no trains for like four hours until about one o'clock. Now I should just point out that it's now raining. <laughs> It's June! It's summer! Why are you raining? Can you see these gents in orange hives? The contractors are out and they're going all around the local stations in this area and they're like giving them all a lick of paint. So if you see uh, the workmen there, they're actually painting up the waiting shelter, which is where I wanted to sit to escape the rain, but now it's, it's, it's they're in there working, doing painty things. Um, is Menheniot a request stop? is the question we need to answer. I've come inside the shelter. There's, there's drops of oh, rain droplets, honestly. I'm going to fire up Wikipedia. I invite you to do the same at home. This is what the Wikipedia entry says about Menheniot Station. Menheniot is served by a limited number of GWR trains. True, it only gets about four or five services. I'll check out the timetable shortly. Uh, on the Cornish Lane Line between Penzance and Plymouth. Most trains only call on request, which means that people wishing to alight need to inform the guard and those wishing to join the train here need to signal clearly to the driver. There is one train per day every morning to London Paddington, with Menheniot being a compulsory stop for this service. I don't think that's true anymore. I think a year ago, or maybe two years ago, Trains just started stopping anyway, and on my map, which I'll throw on screen now and you can download, I need to update my request stop map because certainly back in uh, all the stations 217, 218, Menhenia was a request stop, but I think it now sort of slowly became not a request stop, and I'm pretty sure that right now it is not a request stop at all, so I need to remove Menhenia from my request stop map and update my total of request stops. And I just wanted to see if there's any posters or any evidence that said, is a request stop faded or any sign saying it's now not a request stop. I can't see any at the moment. All I can see are the workmen's gloves and painting. I'll go for an explore just as soon as it stops raining. So remembering that uh, the letter X denotes a request stop uh, on a timetable, you can see here uh, that Dockyard, where I'm going later, has got an X by it. There's an 8.15 there. If you carry on through though, uh, I just arrived on the 9.42 at Menhenia, and there was one earlier at 7.38, there's a 7 o'clock, there's one at 9, there's one at 2, one at 4 something, 5 something, and 7 something. So there's only six westbound trains per day going east. I think it's a very similar pattern. Um, if I want to wait for the next train here, I'm having to wait until two o'clock, which, uh, which is why I can't do that. Now when I leave in a minute, Menheniot village is uh, like a 10 minute walk to the north, but I think my better bet from looking at the onward travel information poster is to walk five minutes to the south, that's where the A38 is, the main road, and there's a couple of bus stops down there that I reckon I can uh, get a bus from. Before I exit, I've just noticed something really strange. GWR, hi. <laughs> Why doesn't Menhenia have any station signs? Looking along the length of the platform, both sides, there is no signage. There is no sign that says 
then Henia. Why are there no station signs? There's a double arrow outside, but there's nothing on the platform to let you know where you are. Uh, it's just occurred to me, what I should do is just call someone that I know will know. So, uh, do you remember, if you've ever watched Least Used Station, Redka British Steel, and Rob that came with me? I'm just going to call him and ask. Hello? Rob? Hello, mate. You're live on YouTube, don't swear. Hello, YouTube. I won't swear. <laughs> uh, Rob, I've got a very simple question for you. Okay. Is Menhenia a request stop? Uh, as of December 2020, Menhenia is no longer a request stop. So it used to be a request stop for uh, a number of years, but uh, as of December 2020, it got, uh, what I say, unrequested. So you don't need to request it now. Unrequested. And now it only gets like five or six trains in each direction a day anyway. It's a very sparsely served station, right? Yes, but it's, it's still a little bit better than what we had. Um, a few years ago, the, the, the route was upgraded between Penzance and Plymouth, which saw a half-hourly service put in uh, between the, uh, the two stations, and uh, a lot more stations get a, uh, a much better service now, including Menhenia. So it's not all that bad. It's, no, it's lovely. Have you been here? Have you ever come here? I've been a number of times. It's uh, I do quite like the station. I especially like the uh, the Brunel shelter, which dates back from 1859. Rob, you can't see this, but I'm pointing at it right now. So that shelter is an 1859 Brunel shelter. Is that correct? Designed by Brunel himself. Rob, thanks so much. Thanks for appearing in my video via phone. You're welcome. <laughs> Hello, YouTube. <laughs> All of YouTube is now waving at you, Rob. Uh, I'll link to the British Red Car Steel video if you want to be reminded of, uh, of whom Rob was. Okay, bye! I didn't actually come here, did I? No, I could have just called him from home. Not a request stop anymore, so I will remove it from my map. I was tempted to stick my arm out, but I, I, I don't think he'd have stopped in time. This station is Menheniot. Yes, it is. There are no trains due to leave this platform within the next 60 minutes. There is a timetable poster available at the station. And there is indeed a timetable poster on the eastbound platform as well, which saw three services this morning around 7, 8 o'clock. Yeah, the next one, the next train that stops, bearing in mind it's uh, only 20 past 10 now, uh, is at 20 past 1. So in three hours' time, they're going the other way. It's not until 10 past 2. So. Uh, with a three hour wait until the next train, I'm going to leave the station and I've decided I'm gonna go and get a bus. Um, and Henniot, it used to be a request stop, it now isn't. Tick. Confirmed. Thanks, Cornwall. I'm at Dockyard. I mean, this is really just a brief coda to the Menheniot uh, request stop slash now it's not a request stop video, but as I was in Plymouth, it seemed rude not to tick off Dockyard, which I'd never ticked off, and that means I could tick another request stop uh, that's on my request stop map. The map, by the way, I threw up on screen, is downloadable uh, in the description. It shows where all the request stops are, minus Menheniot, uh, minus Nucle, minus US, which have all become regular stops again, but it shows all the other uh, request stops uh, in Britain, in England, Wales and Scotland. Still around 120, 130 of them, and uh, we'll have a very, very quick look at Dockyard. It does essentially get a two-hour service because it's on the Tamar Valley line, which are the trains running up to Gunners Lake and back. But there's all about three, four, maybe five mainline trains. You get the uh, HST Castle sets or the IET stopping here. I think actually there's one IET that stops here around sort of seven, eight in the morning, and the rest are just uh, little trains. But you know because the telltale sign, I'm here, so I'm going to get the 1357 there, which has come out of Gunners Lake heading back towards Plymouth because it's got the X, the X next to the time on the timetable. What I can't see, normally there's a sign saying, this station is a request stop. It doesn't say that. Yeah, that's not gonna hold it. I'm having trouble sitting on the bench here in the waiting shelter, mainly because they, they've removed the bench. So uh, it's just the metal supports. I suppose you could perch on those. And there's two ways in and two ways out, so four entrance exits in total to this station, including at the western end coming down this path and these steps, which leads you to this fantastic bridge under the railway. 
and then up these steps back to the other side. And up on the westbound side platform, you come to the end, come to the western end, or northern as it is, and then you do a 180. You've got this rather fabulous view of all the rows of houses across the suburbs of Plymouth. thinking that if you lived here in these houses you would hear the trains go by all the time every two hours up to Gunners Lake plus uh, the mainline ones only a few of which of those of which stop at Dockyard it is a request stop just a quick look at Dockyard I'm going to put my arm out in a minute even though one other passenger has turned up I will make my intent clear uh, and slowly but surely get round all the request stops uh, in England, Scotland and Wales. There's loads in Wales I haven't done yet so fingers crossed uh, I can get round some of those this year. Thanks for watching. Train's coming, as always.